Hello guys, how are you? Sorry I haven't been posting videos lately. Um, I've been overseas actually in the Netherlands, um, just doing some stuff with my music and just playing a few shows. So I apologize for not updating you with a new video, but um, it's been quite hard here without internet and stuff like that. But let's jump right into it. This is gonna be a very quick tutorial just to go into how to change the format of a vocal uh, only in FL Studio. So you don't need any other programs like Melodyne uh, or anything else. Uh, FL Studio can actually do it. So what I mean by changing the format is, uh, for example, how Skrillex does it in uh, Where Are You Now with Justin Bieber's voice. It makes the voice uh, into a uh, flute-like synthesizer. What he does is he changes the format of the, of the vocal. So the vocal stays in the same pitch, but the tonality of the voice has changed. The timbre on the voice has changed. So to do this, it's pretty easy. We just load up a sound in Edison, for example, I have this acapella, Calvin Harris, thinking about you. And uh, all I have to do, basically, it's really, really simple, actually. I've been waiting for this feature on FL Studio for a long time. So uh, on the new version of FL Studio, you can do this. So Command A to highlight or whatever section you want to edit. Time stretch slash pitch shift. And then once you click that, there'll be a little area here called form preservation. It will usually be in the middle like this. And what you're going to have to do is if you want to change, make the vocal deeper, change it to the right. And if you want to make it higher, change it to the left. And for example, uh, if I want the vocal to be lower, uh, I can turn this knob to the right. And uh, if I hit preview, you can hear exactly what it does. If I told you that this couldn't get better, babe. Or this is how it sounds when it's normal. If I told you that this couldn't get better, babe. So it's a really cool trick to get those cool vocals. Uh, your Oliver Heldens does it as well, and so does Don Diablo. This is how they get that kind of sound. So it's really simple technique and works really well. If I turn it off a bit more, you'll hear a significant difference. If I told you that this couldn't get better, babe. And vice versa, if we go the other way, it will make it a lot higher. If I told you that this couldn't get better, babe. And there you go. That's how simple it is to do. Hope you like this tutorial. Please make sure to like, subscribe and comment on this video if this was a helpful video for you. Make sure to share it around for anyone else who would potentially be interested in this. Thank you very much, guys. Ciao.